Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So, for today's topic, I will be talking about my pet peeves. Things that just really irritate me, things that get under my skin. So just to let you guys know, if you're not into me being negative or talking shit or whatever it is, please do not watch this. But if you want to see me rant, if you want to see what irritates me, my pet peeves, what pisses me off, please continue to watch. Okay, so the number one thing that gets under my skin is when people invade my space, my personal space. If I'm standing in line to go buy something or whatever, and you're standing right here, if I can smell your breath, I can smell your deodorant, you are too close. When people take or use or borrow stuff that's mine without asking. Oh my gosh. Seriously, like, how hard is it for you to ask me if you can use my stuff? Is it that hard? Because 10 times out of 10, I'm going to say yes if you ask me. Talking to me first thing in the morning, like when I just wake up. Because I don't know about you guys, but me personally, when I first wake up, I don't want to talk to anyone. Because first of all, my brain is not even like awake yet. So whatever you're telling me, I'm like not even it's not even going in my head because I'm still like asleep that's number one number two I don't know like why but my voice isn't like activated yet it hurts me to talk early in the morning like it hurts my throat I love to sleep and I don't like to wake up also I hate when people are too loud in the mornings do not wake me up if you're not on fire, if you're not dying, if you don't absolutely need me, do not wake me up. Okay, another thing that irritates me is when people say, um, I just sit back and observe. Or when they say, I know a lot, I just don't say a lot. But you're saying stuff right now, okay? Um, like, just don't say it. If you know something, then okay cool keep it to yourself like no one needs to know you know something that no one else knows like cool do you want like a freaking trophy do you want a freaking million dollars like cool congratulations good for you another thing that oh irritates me and causes my road rage is slow drivers don't be a slow driver in front of me oh that makes that makes me so mad this really pisses me off is when people are always on their phones like i get it we have likes we have social media we need to check and everything but if you're hanging out with me if we're having lunch or dinner or i'm trying to tell you a story like get off your phone it's not that hard or like if i'm telling you a story come on like my story is not going to be an hour long you can wait until i'm done with the story or like they're just on their phones like looking down and i'm just like oh yeah so i was going to tell you oh you're on your phone and then, the, and then you try to keep telling the story and they're just looking down at their phone and then you get down the story and then they look up and they're like Oh wait, what'd you say? No. Another thing that pisses me off is being rushed. Oh my gosh. That's so annoying. Another thing I really hate is being interrupted while I'm getting ready. Like sometimes when I'm getting ready I just want to lock myself in my room and like I'm like, tune everyone out, like, do not talk to me, I'm getting ready, like, leave me alone, because, oh, one thing that makes me mad is when, like, I'm trying to get ready, and someone's like, keep, the person that I'm supposed to be going with, they keep interrupting me, and they're like, trying to show me something, or like, do whatever, talk to me, or like, something, and then when I'm not ready, they're the one that's rushing me. Oh my god, no, 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 no. Okay, this one, I don't know why I didn't put it first, because it's like, this one really, really gets underneath my skin is when people say that I'm in a bad mood or that I'm having an attitude when I'm not. Oh my God. Like, how are you gonna tell me I'm having an attitude? How are you gonna tell me I'm in a bad mood? Like, no, I wasn't having an attitude, but if you want, I can have one because you're asking for one. So I'll give it to you if you want it. But no, don't tell me I'm having an attitude if I'm not having an attitude. And trust me, you will know if I'm having an attitude. So don't tell me how I'm feeling. I hate when I'm trying to show someone something on my phone and 
like it's like a screenshot of something or like a picture of something and they take it out of my hand and start using it like it's their own or get out of the picture that I'm showing them and look at other stuff. I get a number to my phone. Do not take my phone out of my hand if I'm trying to show you something. Look, I'm gonna look right here. That's what you do. You do not take it out of my hand. When girls are afraid to eat in front of their boyfriends or someone they're out on a date with. Like what? You mean you're afraid to do something that everyone does? What? I don't understand, like... You're comfortable enough to have sex with him, but you can't eat in front of him? What? You send him booty pictures, but you can't eat in front of him? What? If your boyfriend cannot accept you for eating how you want to eat, he does not deserve you. I eat chicken wings, like lasagna, pizza, anything in front of my boyfriend. Like, I don't care. I do not care. I don't understand why girls do. So that's it for today. That's all my pet peeves, things that irritate me, things that I hate, things that piss me off. I'm sorry if you took offense to any of that. Well, I'm not sorry. But I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh my god, I'm so annoying. <laughs> well, I hope you guys can relate to some of them because I know I'm not the only one that feels like that. Please tell me what your guys' pet peeves are, what irritates you guys, what pisses you off. Please leave it in the comments because I want to know I'm not alone here. Please tell me I'm not alone. Thank you guys for watching. If you made it through this entire video, you are the shit. I love you. And make sure you give this a thumbs up and subscribe to me if you already aren't. And um, if you have any suggestions for future videos, like leave it in the comments. And I will be back next time. Thank you guys for watching.